I play for you. Pa ra pa pa pa. Pa ra pa pa pa. And lamb kept time for a pa pa pa. I played my drum for him pa ra pa pa pa. I played my best for him pa ra pa pa pa. Ra pa pa pa. Ra pa pa pa. Thank you so much, Mr. Pine. No problem, Miss Marsh. is a season of praise and thans thanksgiving for the incarnation of God in Jesus Christ and continues through the day of Epiphany. The name Christmas comes from the season's first service, the Christ Mass. Epiphany comes from the Greek word epiphania, which means manifestation. Therefore, we celebrate Christmas as a symbol of love and happiness. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, teachers, administrators, a pleasant morning to you. Welcome to Frankfort High School Virtual Carol Service 2022. In Ooh. my midst is... <laughs> Mr. Pine as my co-host. Good morning, Mr. Pine. How Good are morning, you this Ms. morning? Marsh. I am doing well. This is actually my favorite time of the year, you know. So I am sure I'll be Same. enjoying this carol service. Yes. <laughs> Same. And I hope our patrons, well, our viewers in this case, our viewers will feel the spirit. All right. Now, to start our program off, we will welcome Mr. Glenn Ansign, right? We have to welcome the presence of the Lord in our midst. So I'm asking Mr. Ansign to lead us in prayer. Thank you. Go ahead and unmute Mr. Ensign. Thank you very much. Good morning, everyone. I trust everyone is in good health and also in good spirits and not spirits within them. Um, let us now invite the creator into our, our presence. Shall we bow our heads in prayer? Kind and loving Father in heaven, we come before you this morning once again to give thee thanks and praises in thy holy majesty's name. We thank you, Lord, for life. We thank you for wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. But most of all, dear Father, we thank you for the great sacrifice you made in giving your one and only son to us, 
so that we might have life and have it everlastingly. At this point in time, dear Father, we give thanks for the privileges you've granted us. And as we approach the end of yet another school term and the end of a calendar year, we thank you for taking us through difficult times. We pray, Father God, that you will help us to reflect on the past few months. We, help, we ask that you will help us to reflect on our successes, on our challenges, on our failures. And we hope, dear Father, you'll give us a strength, the courage to use these to advance our movements in the upcoming calendar and academic year. We pray, Father God, that you'll be through with us through all of our trials and help us, dear Father, to be able to overcome whatever difficulties we're going through. Continue to bless us, dear Father. Continue to guide us as we continue to praise thy holy name. These are the mercies we ask in the name of thy Son, Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Thank you so much, Mr. Anzine. Now we will be moving on to our scripture lesson. And this will be done by Miss Sophia Stewart. Good morning, everyone. Our scripture reading will be taken from St. Luke 2, reading from verses 8 through to 16. And here we go. And there were in the same country shepherds abiding the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were sore afraid. And the angel said unto them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day, city of David, a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. And this shall be a sign unto you, he shall, fi he shall find the babe wrapped in sodden clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there were there was with the angel of multitude of heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest and on the earth, on earth peace, goodwill towards men. And it come to pass, as the angel were gone away from them into heaven, the shepherds said unto another, Let us now go unto Bethlehem and see things which is come to pass, which is the Lord, which the Lord has made known unto us. Last, and they came with haste and found Mary and Joseph and the baby lying I mean, in the middle. Thanks. Thank you so much, Miss, Mrs. Stewart. Now we will hear from our PTA president, Mr. Tommy Stewart to officially welcome us. Thank you, Mr. Stewart. Good morning, everyone, colleagues, visitors, guests to this platform. It is indeed my pleasure to welcome you this morning to the Fernport High School Virtual Carol Service 2021, dubbed Joy Has Come Again. This year's service promises to be an exciting and refreshing event. So sit back wherever you are, whether in your living rooms, at school or at work, as you will be feasting on music, 
drama, singing, and of course, the spoken word. I hope the spirit of the season will come alive as you join our service and your hearts will be blessed. Thank you all for joining us and may you all have a blessed Holy Christmas and a prosperous new year. Thank you so very much. Thank you, sir. Okay, we now invite Mr. Thomas with the greeting. So, for Jay Pan, Krista Marsh, Masters of Ceremonies, our education officer on the platform, Mr. Waydon Christ, teachers, parents, students here on Zoom on our YouTube channel, good morning to you all. Joy has come again. That's our theme for our virtual car service 2021. The staff and students should be proud of the opportunities, success, and achievements realized this year. Friend Court continues to build upon its wonderful reputation. Friends and family, we know that we're still dealing with COVID-19 pandemic and online learning created opportunities and also ways and means to reach to our students. Despite the challenges that exist, we here at Friend Court High School continue to be persistent and resilient as we continue to re-image education as we prepare our students for the future. I want to wish you all the joys and blessing that Christmas brings. The birth of Jesus renews our hope in realizing God's plan for each of us. It is a special time as family and friends get together. We also must focus during the season on the quality of giving and not the quality of the gift. As we remember those who are less fortunate and will not have family or friends to share the Christmas spirit with. Third Court High School family, thank you for your support throughout the year 2021. And we continue to look forward to your support in 2022. On behalf of the Board of Management, staff of Ferncourt High School, we want to wish all our stakeholders happy Christmas and may you have a happy, healthy and successful new year. Joy has come again and I hope you enjoy the rest of our program. Well, Mr. Pine, it seems as if we are down to wait. How That's are you right. feeling? I am excited. I am excited yeah. and I'm ready. Ready, ready, ready. That's okay, it. so everyone, we have a special lineup for you. We will have the word. We will have performances from our lovely cohort of students, yes. right? We will have guest artists, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. right? Now, if you pay any money for them, something here, you know, right? Mm -hmm. Right? We will have appearance from our very own teacher. All right? I can't, I, can't, I can't let it out as yet, all right? right? All right. So, Mr. Fine, let's get straight into it. So, first on our program this morning is no other than Tamelia Darlington. Mary, did you know that your baby boy would one day walk on water? Mary, did you know that your baby boy would save our sons and daughters? Did you know that your baby boy has come to make you new? This child that you deliver will 
soon to live by you. Mary, did you know that your baby boy will give sight to a blind man? Mary, did you know that your baby boy would come a storm with his hand? Did you know that your baby boy has walked where angels trod? When you kiss your little baby, you kiss the face of God. Oh, Mary, did you know? Mr. Pan, do you think Mary? Amazing. So that's again, I didn't hear you. I'm asking if you think Mary knew. <laughs> Unless the angel had told her from the beginning. That was beautiful, man. That was beautiful from, from Familia. Very yeah, beautiful indeed. And Step if I must on. tell you, you know, if I must tell you, I can give you a little heads up behind this. I called, I called her and I said, Darlington, I need you and another student to sing a song for me. She was like, all right, no problem. She came to school yesterday and when she realized the other person wasn't coming again, and I told her, all right, so you go have to sing by yourself. All right, mama says so she's shy, she's nervous, she can't do this or whatever. And look at that. That's, she went ahead it. and she delivered. That was very, that was very, very good. Very, 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 very good. good. Very incredible. Very, very incredible. Good. Very, very incredible. Those notes, you I know, tell you. you know, yeah, I tell you, very good, darling tongue, Tamila, <laughs> darling tongue, with Mary. Did you know? All right, next in line, we have Alia Borland. Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Day. Then man will live forevermore because of Christmas Day. Long time ago in Bethlehem, so the Holy Bible said. Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Day. 
I now hear the angels sing a new king born today. That man will live forevermore because of Christmas Day. Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Day. While shepherds watch their flocks by night, they see a bright new shining star. They hear a choir sing a song, the music seemed to come from afar. Heart now hear the angels sing, a new king born today. That man will live forevermore because of Christmas Day. Long time ago in Bethlehem, so the Holy Bible said. Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Day. Art now hear the angels sing, a new king born today. That man will live forevermore because of Christmas Day. Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Day. I now hear the angels sing, a new king born today. And man will live forevermore because of Christmas Day. Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Day. While shepherds watch their flocks by night, they see a bright new shining star. They hear a choir sing a song, the music seemed to come from afar. I now hear the angels sing, a new king born today. That man will live forevermore because of Christmas Day. I now hear the angels sing, new king born today. That man will live forevermore because of Christmas Day. And man will live forevermore because of Christmas Day. Thank you. No man, thank you, Alia. Thank you, Alia. So, so them come out in the students, them come out when yes, man. Vocals yes, on them, point. Them come right. Out, All right. So, Mr. Pine, it yes. is the season of giving. Right? That's, right. That's right. Season of giving. And Frankfurt is a very generous school, you know. Oh, very, yes. very generous. Right? Mm -hmm. So we have a giveaway. A giveaway. Right? Oh, yes. Yes, man. $200 credit. What to Call say? and text in credit. Mm? So, well, right, so, am I eligible? Where, oh, did you sell? You can uh, clear up on a debt on an offer going in 2022. <laughs> uh, oh, did you sell? Right? I am, so we're I going am to eligible give away then, Miss Marsh. Credit. Pardon me, sir? Am I eligible? Can I participate? Um, teachers, I want, uh, you know, so I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, because enough credits we have enough, so we can oh. make the teachers hop on on this one. Or she should just leave it for the, the students. One, no wonder. I'm wondering. Let's, I'm wondering. Let's, leave, let's, leave, let's give it to the students. Let's give it to them. Give it to the I students? I was just right, Not a problem. Let's so students only. Them. That's right. Students only. That's right. All right. Are we ready? Are we ready? Oh, yes. So the numbers are the digits are 
2802801178339 Is there anyone? Hold on, anyone? never tell Digicel. you never tell him if I lie my Digicel. Uh, I said Digicel, you know, Digicel, 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 Digicel. My bad if no one it. heard. Digicel. 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 Ms. Parks, so can you tell us? Again. Can you tell us if we have a win on the platform on YouTube? I am Miss Park would have to give me that information. Not yet. All right, two eight zero two eight zero one seven eight three three nine two. Not yet. Not yet. Not Did you sell yet. giveaway? Come on, get the credit, man. You know your old digital. Pay up your loan. You Pay know loan. you understand me, Mister Pine. <laughs> Not yet. Please indicate if you have received the credit and say thank you to Friend Court. Yeah. Come on, man. No winners as yet. You think we should do a flow one now, Mr. Pine? You know? Maybe we have more flow users than digital users. Hmm. Think we should move on to flow? I think so. Let's move on. All to right. Flow. All right. Flow. flow credit. Flow. Davina Park said no. Flow credit. Are we ready? Seven seven two five one nine four one zero zero one zero one three. Someone says I should go a little bit slow. No Mr. man, Mr. it's Mr. a competition, Mr. you know. Oh, fast, fast fingers, finger, man. man. Fast, fast finger. fingers, yes. Seven seven two five one nine four one zero zero one zero one three. Fast fingers. Fast fingers. Fast fast fingers. Quick brain. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let me go a little bit slower. Seven, seven, two, yeah, definite, five. Definite one, nine, four, one, one, zero, zero, one, zero, one, three. <laughs> <laughs> no man, no man. We need to. We need to be faster than this. Yeah, come on, winners. Come Someone on, winners. Someone ask to repeat Digicel. Lord have mercy. All right, going back to Digicel, no flow takers as yet. All right, let's go, Digicel. Ready up, you know. You know, so I think you, you know that if we included the teachers, would have gone already, Mr. Pine. You know, I feel so, so for real. But you seeing know, that we're, give, we're giving the students the opportunity to, to, to get this and one, so what? let's see. Let's see if no one right. or not. Digicel users, let's go again. Two eight zero two eight zero one seven eight three three nine two. Come up, did you use us? Come up, did you use us? Fast network, you know. So we have to have fast customers, you know. You Come know? on, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mr. Penny, let's like, say so we have to come back to it. The mess are probably, are probably, Nobody probably, know what, probably, uh, they, they, they got credit, it. $200 you credit, know? you know? It's no, look $100 credit, you know? $200. $200. You know? Mm -hmm. I remember in the days you would have free nights. In this, you understand me and text messages and so yeah. on. Come on, man. Call, you need credit to call up your relatives and wish them Merry Christmas and so on. Come on, man. Well, All I was right, saying, so I was saying though, back. maybe, maybe someone, maybe someone got it and they're just not seeing in the chat or something, you know? Just, Devina that's just my assumption. Devina Parks wants me to say it slow. Devina Parks wants me to say it slow. Oh, man. Let, let's hmm? move on and come back. Let's All move right. on I'm and going come to back. think about it. I'm going yeah. to think about it and then we will and come again. That's it. All right. So we will be moving into a little drama. All right. Now, this presentation is entitled Joy Has Come Again. And it was, it is a devised play, well, skit, yes, by our sixth form students. All right, joy has come again. Enjoy. Of last resort, 
are measures of last resort. We don't want to do them. We don't like to do them. But they are the measures that work when we are in the grips of curfew again. Every meaning we go, we go somewhere curfew this curfew. Chuck ya! We can't even go down before we start on selling things there. Jesus Christ, that's me, I was stressing you. I do not miss this, we all get up before. Lord of mercy, every day me and you know this curfew, this curfew that. When they pick you up, I guess we come out of here. You tell me, see the face now, you know, man? I'm going to make something here, you know. Why if I just go to one more time? How am I supposed to keep church on Zoom? And me can't see my application or nothing like that when my fire just go to every, every minute, so. I can't have that at all, man. Prime Minister Andrew Holness has announced that the nightly curfew has been relaxed by an hour and will now commence at 10 p.m. until 5 a.m. daily as of Friday, December 10, running until Thursday, January 13, 2022. At the same time, there will be a further relaxing of the curfew on Christmas Eve and New Year's Eve to facilitate traditional activities that take place on those days. Jamaicans traditionally observe Grand Market on Christmas Eve. To this end, the nightly curfew will commence at 1 a.m. on Christmas Eve. Boy, Christmas is keep on game, boy! We can't find a little star, but still, no, sir. And your business, but get some people. Sorry, we didn't have to last now.
man, big up to the six farmers. Big up to the six farmers and that skit. All right, we're moving. We're moving now quickly to an audio. A nice little song, a nice little song about you know, this, this Christmas season, this Christmas vibe. All right, just give me one second and we will have it up and ready. All right. But Miss Miss Sparks, I want to ask you a quick question. Where's Miss Sparks? Can you come on for just for just two seconds? Yes, Miss Sparks. Yes, Mr. Pine. No, tell 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 us something. What's one of your favorite thing to do in this time of the, the year, this season? One of my favorite things to do. Yes. Well, it's all about giving. And one of my favorite things to do is to figure out what it is that I can give to somebody, whether it's a gift or just my time. But for me, that is the favorite thing. Giving. Amazing. So tell me, so you, you, you bake, you bake and them thing that too? <laughs> I have not done that for a while, to be honest. <laughs> You haven't done it for a while. Yeah. Not for a while. Yeah, big. Not so for a while. <laughs> Miss Marsh, you say you can't bake. All right, tell you what, Miss Marsh, in the new year, I will be baking and letting you taste it. Yes. Right. Because I, you I, know, I, I like my fruit cake with a little raw. All right, uh, no problem. Not a problem. They will get in there, and for me, it's always the ham. I love the ham. I love, I the, love ham. the ham. And this time, I love the ham. I always, I always run to my sister because you know, my sister lives, my sister lives in Bamboo. So every time when Christmas coming out, I do, I pop my little suitcase from, from, um, probably the 23rd and I met my way up there. I met my way up there because I want, I want when, when, when Christmas Eve come now, the 24th, I am there ready you now. So when Christmas day come now, yes, man, the food and everything is there waiting. And I sure, I sure I enjoy it. <laughs> For sure. All right. But in the same breath, in the same breath, we must remember, we must remember that, you know, the reason for the season is Christ, you know? And as, and as this, this performance that we're going to play, you know, as, as it says, joy has come again. So Jesus came, he came and he brought joy and very much. That's what we're going to celebrate most of all all right here we go Not hearing, Mr. Pine. Oh, you're not hearing? No, not hearing. Ooh. All right. Let's try it. Let me try it again. Let's try it again. Let's try it one more time. Let me know if you're hearing this time, all right? Not hearing. Can we move to something else? Let me, let me figure sure, out. Sure, yeah, man. Sure. All right. So we are going to test. We're going to test some knowledge, right? Yes. So we are going to play emoji pictionary. So I will be showing you some pictures. And you will have to guess which Christmas carol is it. All right, let's go. 
Easy, easy, easy. Nothing to pressure the brain. I promise you. Anyone? Anyone, Miss Park, are you are you um are you seeing any answer in the chat? All right. Someone said silent night. Very good. Silent night. We have be a bright people of Fern Court. All right. Let me move on. All right, technology has a way to fail us, you know. So just give me, all right, easy breezy again. Just a second. Easy, easy, easy. Come on, people, come on, come on, come on. All right, Onelia, Miss Jingle, Jingle Bell, all right, Shamoya Dilla, all right, Mr. Costa, all right, all right. I'm going to go a little bit more technical note. All right, easy, all right. Jingle Bell, all right. You are correct. Even though this is a giveaway, it's a giveaway. It is a giveaway. Jay Palmer, that, 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 that half mark. Sha All right, Shamika Simmons. All right, Mr. Palmer, you get your half mark already. <laughs> All right. All right. Very good. Awesome. Awesome. Yes, Miss Clark. Run off the red nose rain there. All right. Awesome. All right, Mr. Fine. You're ready yes. to blow us away with your voice. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. Come on, we have to. We have to. Okay, Ramona Muir. Very good. All right, she was the first to answer on YouTube. All right, our teachers, our teachers are brilliant, you know, very brilliant set of, set of teachers. All right, big up yourself, Ramona Muir. All right, over to you, Mr. Pine. All right, so let's, let's go.
storms with his hands But you know that your baby boy Has walked where angels try When you kiss your little baby You've kissed the face of God Yes, so Mary did you know again we heard that song for like what the second time. All right. Miss Marsh, you're still here with me. All right. So just like that, just like that, we are let's listen to this Christmas. Listen to Christmas song in the meantime. So yeah, well, listen, Mary, did you know? Yeah, we heard, we heard a little skit, we heard a lot of these different things, but let's take it home for a little bit. Let's take it to Jamaica. Let's enjoy this little Christmas time, you know, in our culture, with our culture. All right? So I know we all know this one, this one. Make the Christmas get you in a good mood. I know you know it. Let's dance and enjoy ourselves together with this one. Here we go.
Christmas catch you in a good mood. All right. Is Miss Marsh back on? All right. Not as yet. That's that's fine. All right. So we have we have a guest. We have a guest speaker that is that's going to, of course, bring us a little word for the Christmas and some little encouragement for the season. So we're going to sit tight. We're going to listen keenly to what such one has to say to us right now. Okay, so this is from Reverend Jason Whitaker. Hello, my friend court friends and family. It is good to be speaking to you on this occasion. And of course, we know each other. You know me, I know you. So let's get into it. I was asked to speak to you on the theme, Joy has come again. Joy has come again. We know the story of Jesus Christ born in a manger and he is the promised son that is to come to be ruler of the earth and all those nice and sweet things. Anybody hear that? Joy to the world. What if Jesus Christ did not come? How would things look for us? How would this world look? How would we even um, survive and, and, and stay and live in this world? I want to speak to you about three things that would happen if Jesus Christ did not come. First thing is that we would not know the fullness of love we would not know the fullness of love. All of us know the Bible verse that says that God is love and he loves us because, because we love him because he first loved us. God loves us. Jesus Christ loves us. And so, as a matter of fact, he loved us so much that the Bible says that what manner of man is this that he loves us so much that he would lay down his life for us that he would die for us that love is unimaginable that love is unconditional there is no condition that is attached to it so jesus christ doesn't love us because we go to church or jesus christ doesn't love us because we're babies or jesus christ doesn't love us because we give him anything he loves us because he just loves us and so his love is without condition. And so if Jesus Christ did not come, we would not know what it really means to love. 
he laid down his life to show us that love and the bible says greater love as no man than this that god or someone that jesus christ would lay down his life for us and so if jesus didn't come we would not know the fullness of love we would not know what it means to love unconditionally imagine loving your parents imagine loving your spouse imagine loving that significant other that girlfriend or boyfriend imagine that love that you have for that person that if someone were to hurt or come between those that that relationship you would be pissed you would be mad now imagine you put all of that love together and jesus christ's love for you and i still surpassed that that's a lot of love and so if jesus christ did not come in that manger as a baby then we would not know what it means to really love unconditionally secondly if jesus christ did not come we would not have that personal relationship with god anybody hearing that song Let's get back to it. If Jesus Christ didn't come, we would not have that personal relationship with God. Imagine this. Back in the days, in biblical times, there were persons who, when they needed to go to God or to speak to God, they would have to go to the church or the temple. They would have to bring with them a goat, a sheep, a bird. And what they would have to do is they would have to kill that goat, kill that sheep, kill that bird, kill that cow, and then make a sacrifice. And then they would have to go into the temple and then they would have to speak to the pastor or speak to the, the, the prophet or speak to the, the priest in the temple. And then that priest would pass their message on to God. Imagine that. But because Jesus Christ came, he says that we have no been granted access directly to God. So I can go in my room, in the privacy of my closet, even in the privacy of my own bed, I can even stand and say, God, well, go on. And he hears me and he responds to what I'm saying. So if God, if Jesus Christ did not come, I would not know what it means to have a personal relationship with God. Because he comes, he says that I will allow you to have that personal relationship where you can talk to God one-on-one -on -one with true pride. You don't have to pretty up anything because with the priest or with the pastor, you might want to pretty up things and say, you know what, let me speak eloquently so that the pastor or the priest may translate eloquently to God so that God may grant my request. And I know many of you want Christmas gifts and Christmas presents and so on and so forth that you would have to go to him to say Please pastor, please pass this message on to, to God for me. But Jesus Christ came and he said Listen, I have granted unto you the Spirit of God and so that you can speak to God without any barriers. And so because Jesus Christ came we have that direct access to God and because of that direct access we have now a relationship with God that is amazing and thirdly if Jesus Christ never came as a baby in that manger we will we would not have joy in our hearts joy as come at so because Jesus Christ came we have no joy in our hearts if he didn't come we wouldn't have joy in our hearts we would know what joy means we would know what it means to really have joy in our hearts as a matter of fact we wouldn't have this lovely heart, this lovely place, this lovely 
connection that we have. Have you ever been at church and you know you're singing nice songs and it is a lovely afternoon and praise and worship is going on so nice and it is Christmas of course and you're feeling that Christmas breeze just brushing across the face? Have you ever been there? Have you ever felt what it felt like, feels like to have someone coming from foreign for Christmas and then they just come and they bring a nice present for you and you feel something tingling in your heart? And then you feel that, that, that first feeling that you feel when you first receive something that you have longed for and you feel it here in your heart. That is joy. And that is the joy that Jesus Christ brings to us. He doesn't just bring that joy at Christmas. He brings that joy every single day of our life. And so if you know him, Jesus Christ brings joy. Joy to the world, the Lord has come. Let her receive her King. Let every heart prepare his room and heaven and angels sing joy to the world. Joy has come again and we will rejoice because joy has come again. Have a blessed Christmas. God bless you. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. All right, so as Miss Marsh said earlier, we have a guest artist. We have a guest artist, and we're going to hear from him now. So with no further ado, let's go ahead and play the performance for our guest artist. Go ahead, Miss Parks. Hello, Frankfurt High School. As we celebrate this season, let us remember the reason for the season, right? We are celebrating the life of our Savior and Lord Jesus Christ. And we know that all our lives, He has been faithful to us. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Let's raise hands across the platform as we do thanks.
Thank you very much. So we just heard from Mr. Marvin Bloomfield. He just delivered those two beautiful songs for us. I put you in front of my melody, and I believe the other one was. Was it again? Somebody want to remind me? The first one. Yes, your goodness is running after me. There we go. Amazing. So we are coming down nicely. We are approaching the end. But before we go, we have another performance from another teacher. Right? And I'm sure you'll be excited just as though I am excited. So we are going to hear from Miss Parks. And then we will take it further. Let's go, Miss Parks. Go ahead. Good morning, everyone. A ray of hope flickers in the sky. A tiny star lights up way up high. And all across the land, does a brand new part. When a child is born, a silent wish sails the seven seas. The winds of change whisper in the trees, and the walls of doubt crumble, tossed and torn. This comes to pass when a child is born. A 
rosy hue settles all around. You've got the feel that you're on solid ground. And for a spell or two, no one seems so long. Is this how survives when a child is born? It's all a dream and illusion now. It must come true. Sometime soon, somehow, and all across the land, does a brand new morn. This comes to pass when a child is born. This comes to pass. When a child is born. Wonderful. This comes to pass when a child is born. I haven't heard that song in a while. Thank you very much for that reminder, Miss Sparks. All right. So earlier we did earlier we did the little credit giveaway. And apparently we're not sure if, if anyone got it. So here we go again. We are going once more. This time we are going to starting off with the flow credit. All right. So flow users, get your, get your phones together. Get your phones up and ready. Ready? Here we go. So star. One, two, one. Star. Ready? Flow. Star one, two, one, star. Eight. Four. Nine, four, six. Eight, nine, eight, two, five, four, seven, seven, one. Let me know who is the big winner. Let me know who is the big winner for this flow credit. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Waiting to hear ta da 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 Nothing yet. Nobody yet. Nobody at all. No man, I can't believe you guys don't want the credit. Is it that you're not you're not telling us that you win the, that you want the credit, you know? Repeat, please. What was that? What was that? I should repeat it. All right, let's go again. Let's go again. I'm just repeating it one more time, and we're moving on to the digital one. All right, flow users, you have to get, you have to be quick. Here we go. Star one, two, one, star. Eight, four, nine, four, six, eight, nine, eight, two, five, four, seven, seven, one. Let's go, flow users. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Any winner? Do we have any winner? Not yet. Miss Park, Miss Park, you look like, you know, you look, Miss Park, sorry, Miss Park, you know, you look like we're going to have to include the teachers in this one. But we're going to have to include the teachers in the next one, you know, because not getting, we're not hearing anything from the students at all. Not knowing if they're winning or not. All right. So, all right, so teachers, for the teachers with the flow, with the flow, the flow devices, I am sorry. I am sorry, I am sorry, because we only have one leave, one left, and that one is for the digital users. <laughs> so that's where we are at, all right? 
So digital users, teachers, you are included, administrative staffs, everyone else, you are included. Here we go. All right. So star one, two, one, star, star one, two, one, star four, seven, zero, three, three, nine, five, eight, six, six, one, nine, six. Let me see the quick fingers now. Let's see the quick fingers. Let me see the quick fingers. Let's see the quick fingers. Let me see the quick fingers. Let me do one more time, one more time. The star one two one star. Here we go. Four seven zero three three nine five eight six six one nine six. Here we go. Ain't nobody don't want no look credit in a look Christmas time, man. I just repeated it. I repeated it twice. Nobody. No one. All right, I'm repeating it one last time. Also, someone said someone got the flow. Someone got the flow. So big up, big up to the person who got the flow credit. Big up, congratulations. You can bra for your Christmas. <laughs> so we're repeating it one more time. No, Lando, I cannot say it slowly. I cannot say it slowly. It's a competition. So you have to be quick. You have to be quick. All right. Here we go. One more time. So star. One, two, one, star. Here we go. Eight, four, nine, four, six, eight, nine, eight, two, five, four, seven, seven, one. Just like the flow winner, let us see if we have a. Let's see, if we have. See if you have a DJ winner. Not as yet, no. It says voter invalid. So I, I, I am probably assuming that someone, someone got it as well, and it's not, and it's not saying so. All right, so that's where we are at. That's where we are at in regard to the giveaways. Miss Park, Miss Park, do we have another giveaway? So you're back with us. You're back with us, Miss Marsh. Man, you left me alone, but I understand. I understand. Technology, you see, man. Technology, technology. man. Technology. So, so I can't man. wait for face to face, you see. You understand me? I can't wait right. for face to face. But I know you, I know you hold the fort. I have no doubt. You know, I, I tried. I tried. I tried. I tried. <laughs> I believe in you. Awesome. All right. So it seems that we're not, we don't, we're not sure. If anyone got the credits, but you know, we just have to move on. We have to move on. All right. I think I I I I, I have some difficult um pictionary um emoji games. And I want to see who can get these ones because those were relatively easy, you know. So I dig up a little more and I say, hmm, let me see if they have a figure out this one. So you think if you Go along with it, Mr. Pine. What you yeah, think? Yeah, man, go on, man. Shoot it. All right, we could challenge them now. All right, yes. let's go. All right. Um, allow me to screen share, please. <laughs> because I drop off. I don't have the right to screen share.
I think the host would have to give you that privilege. Ms. All Marsh. right. Okay, not a problem. All right. All right, Mr. Pine. Yes. We are down to the nitty gritty of things. Mm -hmm. Nitty yeah. gritty, nitty gritty, nitty gritty. All right. So, on behalf of Frankfurt, no matter what language you speak, a kind and smiling thank you always speaks to everyone's heart. On behalf of Frankfurt High School, we would like to extend sincere thanks to the Almighty God for making today's event a resounding success. With his blessings and grace, we are able to make this event what it is. Thanks to Pastor Whitaker, who spared the time from his busy schedule to prepare such a creative and refreshing presentation. Today, we had an opportunity to hear your thoughts, and this will surely encourage us in future events. Your thoughts have enlightened our minds and have shown, shown us a new path. Special mention to our respected principal, Mr. Thomas and management for being the catalyst that stimulated us to do our best and standing as pillars of strength. With a deep sense of appreciation, we also would like to thank our loving teachers for their untiring efforts. To the organizers and supporting team, we have been fortunate enough to be backed by a team of very proactive and dedicated staff of our institution who are well versed in their job. Our sincere gratitude goes to all parents and well-wishers for your rock solid support system and encouragement. Without your support, children would not be able to achieve excellence. Thank you so much for gracing us with your presence. Merry Christmas and a prosperous 2022. Thank you for making it.